Hello and welcome back. My name is Kirby Beatbox. It's actually two patterns we're gonna learn today, and both are gonna be by Pash. So this is the second uh, video about Pash patterns, and uh, yeah, he he makes a lot of great patterns. That that's why I use his patterns. The beat he made against Trang Bao in the final was this. And um, so his uh, ish snare, the uh, uh, he makes that very uh, high pitched, and I can make it as high pitched as him. The tricky part about this is the ish snare, and uh, if you can make that, uh, high, likely you can't. Uh, the way I can explain it is you talk in words like hello, hello, hello. I hope you can talk in words, and then you make it high pitched like hello, 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 hello. And then you make one inward talk, like very forceful, like <laughs> and uh, high pitched, like <laughs> like inward, like <laughs> I can't explain it in, in another way, but I will link a tutorial that Dubby did on this sound, and I hope that will help you. The first sound is a lip bass. <laughs> And uh, yeah, search up the tutorial for that if you can't make it, but it's called lip bass, and I will call it LB in here, LB, lip bass. You make the lip bass, and so, then you take a little break, and then you start with a, it's not, it's, The sound is coming in a very uh, like rhythmic order, and uh, yeah, it's it's not that difficult. So the sound just got down right exactly now, and I saw I was getting a very dark. So uh, now I got some light. I hope you can see me now. I know it's not the best light. I know, but uh, this is what you get to get that thing, the transition in the to back to the beginning. You gotta get. You gotta make the double K snare, and to make that, you gotta make a outward K, as you probably can make. And then right after that, you make an inward K snare, so. Put the hi-hats in the beginning. Very useful sound. And then you make a inward peck snare, I think it's called. It's an inward uh, snare. It's like <laughs> putting a lot of tension on your lips, inwards, and uh, then you release. And then you get the forceful sound. <clears throat> okay. So, yeah, that's the transition. You just gotta learn it. You gotta learn it, and then you can get the pattern down. And that's that would be cool, right? Practice slowly this part, and you probably get like. <laughs> it's a difficult pattern. Pattern. It's like a professional pattern, and so on. I'm not. If you're a beginner, you're probably not gonna get this as fast as you might have wanted to. But you gotta stay with it and try to practice it over and over again. But at least you got the pattern, and that's amazing. It's amazing to have a pattern to practice on. The next pattern by Pash uh, comes right here. Special sound. I thought the beat sounded a bit like this. And 
And to make that, you gotta make the throat page. Wow, throat page. <coughs> gotta be able to make the double case now again. <coughs> and also gotta make to me. You gotta be able to make that. <coughs> Even if you can't hear it, it's it's there. And also gotta learn the hollow clap. The pattern is right here. The first thing you gotta do is make the throat bass. I write it as boom and then M. Boom, M. The first thing you just say throat bass. You say boom with the throat bass. And then you make it a lip bass with throat bass. Just make that. I hope you can make it. Small letter case, uh, outward case, now that I the way. And uh, O is uh, throat kick. <laughs> so just practice pattern, you got the pattern here, like... <laughs> And you should get the pattern down. Uh, and it's a very cool pattern as well. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. I hope this helped you out. I hope you like these videos. I enjoy making these videos. I learn a lot from these videos as well. I think it's important to make uh, new patterns all the time because otherwise you might uh, lose motivation when making beatboxing. And also you get closer to being a professional if you make beats by professionals. So that's why I think this is a great idea. And I really think you should make these patterns because hopefully you will get more motivated to beatboxing because if you make the same patterns all the time, that's not fun. In my opinion, you gotta keep it fresh, you gotta keep it new, and with these videos you can make it. So, stay tuned for my next video, and that's gonna be awesome. I'm sorry this video is a little bit late. I'll better myself, and uh, yeah. Please leave a like if you enjoyed, if you learned something, or if you're gonna practice this. And comment down below what you thought about the video, or anything else. Comment about literally anything you want to, because I love to get your comments. Share the videos you want to. Subscribe as well. And I'm very thankful that I got like 90 subscribers. There's a lot of subscribers. Like, wow. Cool. Thank you very much. I'm all, we're almost at 100, and that would be amazing to get there. I'm looking forward to it. And my name is Kirby. And I am out. They make one, like uh, one, uh, like a. Um